done it on purpose. Talking boom. I'm finna be like, ayo, bro. Run my fade. Yo, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another Game of Love 6 video where today, um, before I even say the title, I apologize, alright? I had family over, so, like, I really couldn't do a lot, I really couldn't do any videos, like, so, like, I couldn't record a video, video, the day of New Year's. Uh, this is the first video of 2023, so, that's good, that's good, but, um, yeah, we finna kick, we finna kick things off with, um, CJ the champ stink meaner the personification of hatred he oh my god bro stink if y'all have not watched the boondocks watch it bro like it is a very good show oh my god is it funny and do they use the n-word a lot bro all right but like yeah we're just gonna get into this before we start please like and sub for the youtube algorithm and um yeah, that's basically it. Let's enjoy the video. Hold up. Ah. <clears throat> Hatred. Hatred. To dislike a nigga intensely or passionately, to the point where you completely detest and despise that nigga on a ah. daily <laughs> basis. I know you like, see, ladies and gentlemen, there are just many haters in fiction just in general. For an yes. example, Reverse Flash. Yeah. I mean, yo, this man hates oh so my much. God, bro, he hates the Flash with the Flash with all his might. He literally finds new ways to kill him in new timelines. This dude is a DC menace. He's a DC men bro. This dude is a freaking menace. That's it, bro. He would. Oh my God. He could do a whole video on Reverse Flash, bro. I don't even know if you call it hating at this point. It's exactly. like a severe case of he's, meat munching. He's hell. just devious. Then obviously, you know, we got your D.O.'s, your freezers, <gasps> your yeah. flat nose, no nostril, the Voldemort, <laughs> oh. the smell. And yo, you even got your scars. Ah, Scar, please help me. Hate what the fuck? Pull me up. Long live the king. I am your motherfucker. Ah! <laughs> But ladies and gentlemen, the man that we're gonna do him like that might be one of the most despicable, vile, disgusting, and ignorant human beings to ever grace God's yes. earth. The personification of hatred. Stink meaner. H. Stink, Stink meaner. Uh. 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 CJ the champ. CJ the champ. CJ the champ. CJ the champ. Uh. We got real good to do it like that, bro. Warning spoilers. Right, ladies and gentlemen, to understand the philosophy of stink meaner and basically this entire video, ladies and gentlemen, I must explain to you the nigga moment. An altercation oh. caused by ignorance overwhelming the logic otherwise rational thinking of a brother. Of a now brother. watch closely as I personally give you a demonstration. Yup. Hey, watch where you going, nigga. Hey, man, <laughs> what you say to me, cuh? Now, as you can see, watch where you go. is ready to pop a cap in each other's asses. Oh, God. So they start to get the blasted in this every single shot like they just got off the set of a How many? Movie. And once Yo, they realize many... they just both wasted each other's time, they mm -hmm. end up figuring out that they just wasted their life away. Hey. Boom, boom. Police brutality. Now, since we have more of an understanding, it don't work with all people, here, though. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Colonel H. Stinkmeter. Stink now, even back in his childhood, Stinkmeter was always a. Why is his eyebrow like that, bro? He didn't care for beautiful sceneries, sunsets, rainbows. He just disliked happiness in general. Man, this some old bush. At age 15, Stinkmeter lost his eyesight to cancer. But the thing is, mm -hmm. he didn't care. He was just glad that he ain't had to see sh no more. So doctors he was like, I don't want to see the world's happiness. Screw that. Life. So he decided for those three years, he would dedicate his life to spread misery and hatred. Oh, all no for way. just sing giggles. And the thing is, people don't even know how he lived to become an old man. All they just say is basically a simple yeah, the hatred. I don't know how he lived as long day. as he now, did. I'm surprised no one ran his crazy. Oh, yeah. 
bro, he the did not care. In the world. Jesus Christ, it's like truck who I'm looking at this man. dude like, nigga, no, you no, on the no, wrong no, side no, of the no, road, goddamn. Exactly. You should be ashamed of yourself. Now, as we can see, this man is speeding through a parking lot going at least 50. And he starts to I'm surprised he didn't. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. That's disrespect, like, bro. Who in the hell parked in my space? That's like calling 1 800 collecting ass whooping. You better get a shirt. Are you blind? Yes! I'm blind! You got a problem, problem with, with that? that? Yeah, <laughs> go! <laughs> like Robert Freeman has been trapped in a new yeah, so Huey says, it is hard to get out of. Somebody. And this man's stink meter like, oh, I'll be doing them a favor. I'm blind. You got a problem with that? Yeah, girl. And giving your holy communion. Oh, mm. Lord, look what you did to my car. Brother, you best have it's insurance. Yeah, girl, you, you better, better have insurance. insurance. With insurance? insurance? <laughs> you about to pay a deductible. Now, ladies and <laughs> gentlemen, <laughs> can either do two things right now. He could do A, walk away and let insurance handle it, yes. or B, fight with an old crazy blind man. And uh, let's blind just say nigga. this brother chose B. I would have chose B, just bro. Start pressing him. He just starts spitting in his face. He like, what you gonna Good do, dude, huh? What you gonna do? Jazz, jazz, fuck ass, bitch, oh, nigga. oh, oh. You gonna do something about it, Ooh. bitch, ass, nigga. Damn. Then Stink Meaner ends up doing one of the most oh, evil, demonic, and despicable things I know you can what he's ever do, do to another man. He's finna. Hold up. Is that some I fresh kick? This man smells like that man shit, nigga. Nigga. Nah. Oh, hell no. You nah, step, bro, yo, you step on a nigga's brand new shoes. Oh, let me just say this. If I ever get new shoes and someone stepped on it on purpose, talking boom. I'm finna be like, hey, yo, bro, run my fade, run my fade, bro. We finna have to fight. We finna box after man, this. Bro. Bro, I just bought these hoes from Foot Locker like five minutes ago. Exactly. Nine, nine, it didn't even last like a day. Bro, pulled back his whole leg. Exactly. Had that hoe at a 90 degree angle. And we make yeah. a boom. Nah, bro, that's how you know he ain't got no respect for you. He, he like, disrespectful. Yeah. They ain't doing him hard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, then this was the final straw that made Granddad take. So Granddad swing at him, but we swing by the better. Oh, like, ah, boom! Granddad took a massive like, L. Me, Jesus Christ, my brother, you just got your ass beat by an old blind man. So Huey it's, had to stop. Him. Yeah. Like, nah, bro, it's over. So later on, after Granddad was just fully embarrassed. Everybody just start making fun of him. Yeah, like, eh, Riley, especially the news, multiple and news later channels. That night while Granddad cleaning his shoes, bro, I look on the news and he like, "This just in: a fight at Woodcrest Mall broke out today with an older blind man in another." Boom! Like, and it wasn't just local news. CNN, bro, CNN. and international news. Brother Telemundo, in bro, City, come on now. Nah. So then the phone started ringing, and guess who left a voicemail? Uncle Ruckus. Hello, Robert. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I know you must be feeling embarrassed right now. So you know what? I would feel embarrassed too. Some KFC, Kentucky Fried Chicken. Robert, Kentucky hello. Fried Chicken. Don't you walk away from this ass man. So Get your so ass back to the back to the answering machine. Found Stink Meter and challenged him to a fight. So Granddad started training thinking he Ali or something. Cause Huey was like, Granddad, you don't know what you're doing. Hey. This man is like a blind samurai or something. I had a dream well, maybe about he just the got other lucky. night. He's like that. And then on the other he side, really liked that. Riley ignorant ass promoting this like we Hey bro, he getting bread. Or something. So now oh, it's the night of the fight and it is packed. Riley out here overcharging for ten dollars. So they start Oh now nah, you bugging bro. Like, yeah. You scared? You scared, ain't you, bitch, nigga? Damn. Man, I can smell the bitch right off of you. Damn. Man, that's vintage. So he starts swinging, and then Huey ends up realizing, oh my god. He got this lucky. Ain't no trained blind samurai. He ain't got super hearing or nothing. He was just a blind old man that just got lucky. Exactly. So like, Wait, hold on, Granddad. But it was granddad, Granddad, turn. chill. Granddad started whooping that ass. Yo, he was out for smoke. And started kicking the 
and then boom, that final, boom, he dead. And he didn't just knock him out. Granddad he killed him. Killed him. He was out for smoke, bro. Well, because he got trapped in a the moment. Exactly. So yeah, that was Exhibit A, and it's time to move on to Exhibit B. Not Tom. Right, he gentlemen. possessed now Tom, bro. You exhibit B, the return. So as we know, Stink Meter died. Mm -hmm. But little did we know, this was just the beginning. This man is in hell training Train. with the devil. He was training in hell, bro. Demons. And even the devil said, He's the baddest motherfucker I've ever seen. <laughs> the devil to acknowledge that he is the baddest fucker he's ever seen. That is the most legendary feat of all time. He even called the devil a bitch ass nigga. So the devil said, Little H. Dink Meter, I am now sending you back to spread ignorance and hatred in the black community. This is not the actual. Hell ain't shit. I'm coming for you, Freeman. So meanwhile, we bro, he was over time. everyone. Was basically everyone, bro. Of the brothers that is out of touch with his people. But even in hell, Meter and knew now in the overworld, taking over Tom's body. So this dude ends Snigger up cutting off Tom number. and taking his. Hey, that's body. disrespectful, so bro. Like, come on hey, now. Hey, come on, man, you ninka poop. Ninkin poop. Hey, 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 come back here. I had my turn signal on and everything. But then the dude turned around and yeah. just started cussing them out. He like, F you punk ass, pussy ass, weak Damn. ass. Damn. Damn. Deal. Deal. We can see Tom has been trapped in a nigga moment. Exactly. And this was a perfect hey, he can easily walk away to make his move. Exactly. <laughs> what is that, nigga? I'll kick you. your you ass in your chest, nigga. Ago, and you got kicked in your chest. You eat a dick, nigga. You, you eat, eat a dick. dick. Oh, oh, my God. I am so sorry. Uh, so, so, somebody call an ambulance. Hey, help. Oh, no, he good. He good. He good. No Tom worry. has been possessed by Stink Meter. Mm -hmm. So this man, Stink Meter, got him acting up in the courtroom. Or got up in there and said, F*** your court, nigga. Mm. Then later on, bro goes home to Tom's wife. And he's like, oh, yeah, I want to beat up them booty cheeks. Oh, Tom, uh, what has gotten into you? The same thing that's about to get into you. And he beats his wife's cheeks up. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 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 no, I forgot. As you know, I don't think I've seen this. Hey. Let's be honest, we would all bag that shit. Come on now, Get come on, yo, Tom. And using your body to beat up on your girl, dude. Oh, God, bro. Crazy. So then say you wouldn't, bro. Come on. Say, if you say you wouldn't, you know. Now, I don't know what Robert looking up on the toilet, but the sensor bar is going crazy right now. Yeah. So, dude yeah. starts tearing the door yeah. down with an axe, and he's like, I'm here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but, yo, God. what in the shining is going on right now? So, Granddad started running oh, down yeah, the bro. steps. Oh, yeah, bro. Man's Jesus was in his Christ, this purple, tiny white, out. whatever you call it. saying, you don't remember me? You, you don't, don't remember, remember my name? No. What's my, my name, name you yeah, car? I my name. Robert, what's my, my name? name? So then Huey finally says his name. He's like, ding, ding, ding. ding, ding. ding. That's, That's right, nigga. Right, so then all the Freemans get ready to jump him. So they get boom, this crap. Boom. This man's skin okay. going crazy. We're a bomb. Ah. Smack Riley around. Damn. And he is still damn, damn. 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 Yo, did you see Granddad's neck set? Uh. Like, is that all y'all got? Yeah, yeah God. God. Look at his backhanded Huey. Oh, my gracious. So they finally end up pinning him down. Damn, and Riley damn. had to smack this man with like three. It's a collectible. Boom. To boom. finally just knock him out. You, so later bro, on, they got him restrained crazy. on this bed, and Robert is having this date. So in the middle of his date, Stick me to wake up, and he like, Robert, I know you hear me, you bitch. I know you hear me, bro. I know you didn't vote this year, you lousy nigga. You weirdo. Wait, wait, hold on, baby. That's just a TV. 
So they mm. end up having to call the Catholic Church to exercise this man. Ah. So there was only one man that could save the day. Ruckus. May God bless you, Robin. I came as fast as I could. So let's go ahead and get down to business. Removing oh. the evil spirit from a brother is as hard as getting rid of a hunk of shit. So we yep. must use these holy weapons from God himself. A bunch of weapons that I will not say because mm -hmm. dear God, I will get demonetized. The brother will make excuses. <laughs> I remember if he all get those desperate, weapons, that bro. brother may try to rap. Oh, yes, you can hear it. Robert, I, I know you got bad credit. So they get up in yeah. this room and Ruckus pulls out the Bible and says, Read, read the nigga, read. 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 <laughs> saying so Phrases that I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I know I'm not the most family friendly, but uh, I, I, I ain't saying it. But then you <laughs> to realizing this ain't doing nothing. So they kept on doing this for like several hours, and then they ended up figuring out that the only way to expel his peace, spirit bro. was to create peace with him. Oh, and God. the only way to do that was for Ruckus to make him laugh about how much he hates brothers, and that finally ended yep. up My man his got sent back to the. Back down to hell. Exhibit C. The, oh, but this group was disrespectful. Now Exhibit C. More, the bro, they were devious, so even bro. though that stink meaner is now long dead and gone, oh, he God. still had a crew that wanted to come back and get it back in blood. Ladies and gentlemen, they meet the hateocracy. hate-ocracy. A group of bitter old hating bro, ass. Bro, they stand back for that man, bro. Stink meaner, Lord Rufus Crabmeister, mm -hmm. Lady Esmeralda Gripe Nasty, and Mr. George mm -hmm. Pistofferson. Now you see, they all met at a retirement home and they all hated each other. But, they but the thing but they, they hated had everyone in common more. is that they hated everybody else even more. Oh, so God, they, they decided did. to cause Boom. complete chaos at the retirement Poor Granny, bro. Bingo parties. B four. B four. Uh, bingo, nigga. sucker. Now what the, the hell are we? Give me that. Shit. Give me Eventually, that. it got to the point where they had to kick him out. But hey, that, that didn't hey, stop hey, it was because gonna happen they one roamed the another. earth for a decade causing chaos. Eventually, till they, they split, split up. up. But because of the death of Stink Meter, the Hateocracy reunited to get it back in blood. So meanwhile, we cut over to Ruckus working at this gas station. And this is their first pool. appearance. So they come up Look to at the what they do Ruckus to Ruckus, like, oh, bro. hell no. What the hell y'all want? We looking for someone. Are you sure it's someone or something? Because you should be looking for the zoo. What y'all looking for? The Curious George exhibit? We looking for a man named... Robert Freeman. Oh, hell no. Y'all know Robert? Y'all best get to stepping before I send y'all ass to hell on. So you telling me you know Robert then? Oh, Ugh. my God. Looks like I can find where he is if I beat your fat, googly, one-eyed ass to death. Damn. Whip his ass, Rufus. Yup. Breaking, Breaking news. news. The man at a gas station was jumped by three assailants. Look at blood. what they did. The victim, Mr. Uncle Ruckus, no relation, no had relation. this to say. Oh, Lord, that, that, that Look, was bro. Oh, they, they must have Two the broken zone. arbs, a, a freaking concussion, his eye, bad. that guy, yeah, his glass Ruckus eye, and you. everything else is so just... So later that day, George and Esmeralda pull up to Huey and Riley's school, and I they know. like, oh, yes, we're the grandparents of the Freemans, and uh, we're here for checkout. Yeah, that's right. We're here for checkout, fool. So Huey and the Riley... Obviously, something ain't right. Yeah, so they, go they don't got any uncles. There they are. Well, 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 we came a long way to kill y'all little motherfuckers. And dog, look at this jump. Uh, uh, they got oh, acrobat. Nah, back. This is some anime, bro. If I see a pair of 75-year-olds moving like this, I already know I'm about to get my ass. Exactly. They start to get the scrappy, and they is teeing off. Oh, oh my yo. God. And look at Esmeralda. Oh, bro, look at oh, Riley, me, bro. Riley was like, oh, bro, these niggas trying to attack us. Look at how he's getting combos. But she hit him with that gripe nasty That's, a, that's so exactly like Naruto. Not a single brain, hit, bro. bro. Hey, at, at least Yui evaded up, some of it. Up out he didn't evade. Riley didn't evade any of this it. Was happening, Robert ends up going fishing. And he then ends up has, running into Rufus. Has, so he's bro, like, come he, on, how are you doing? He scrapped up with this dude, much. bro. I'm just thinking about catching fish. I might catch one more today. Tell me, sir. Do you know a man by Sting Meter? Oh, wait. You already should, because you killed him. Robert, Robert Freeman. Freeman. So Bruce starts swinging this. Boom. I don't 
don't even know what that is. So yeah. Robert starts I have yet to know what that's called. Like a crab catcher. Thing, but Robert kicks the barrel of crabs in his face. Oh, Lord. Uh. So later on, he ended up hiring Bushido Brown to be a bodyguard. Mm. So the head officer ended up pulling up to the house. So they start getting ready to jump this man Bushido Brown. Come on, Bushido. Boom, boom. Oh, Come yeah. on, Bushido. Girl, yeah. That bitch. Went, Take that wig off. Nah, bro, this man Bushido Brown was cold. But I say was because uh was. Cause life was past tense. Bro, this car, man, like, and, oh my god. <clears throat> you know you got oh, sexual damn. stuff on YouTube because uh, <laughs> you're that new policy. You don't want to make Mama Susan mad now, do you? Granddad <laughs> <laughs> right started apologizing. He's like, okay, bro, listen, listen. I'm sorry. You I know, I know how this ends. I am sorry. I had a nigga moment. But then they end up saying. You don't care about that goofy ass nigga. Exactly. I beg your pardon. Oh, God. Yeah, he was our nigga, but it don't mm. matter. We just came to f shit up. Exactly. What? Look at Riley with this crying this ass. This whole time you thought, oh, they coming back to get it back in blood. No. Nah. They literally came and did all this. All for sh and giggles. No, mm -hmm. bro, this is crazy. That's just hating to another level. So that they is. about to kill him, but luckily the cops the, came the and they just arrested him. The cops came through, bro. And the, the state meaner saga finally came to an end. No more stink me. Exhibit D. Wait, wait, what? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Uncharted Territory. The territory okay. where legends... Okay, yeah, I welcome didn't see this. to Exhibit D. I now present uh, there's you never been an Exhibit D. So you see, Stink Meaner wasn't done messing with Robert because he had a clone. You see, Stink Meaner answered the ad on uh, blackpeoplemeet.com and ah. the government made a clone of him. So he gets his note from the original Stink Meaner and it says, Dear Clone Me, go f with that nigga Robert from OG Stink Meaner. So later on, Robert is at the mall and he sees the back of his car is rammed into again. And he guess who did it? What's good, Stink Meaner? That's right. I ran into I'm your car. I'm back in the and flesh. I didn't even want to park there. I just wanted to f up your car and wait here to tell you about it. So Robert's like, oh, nah, no, bruh. I ain't having this today. I'm just going to have to kill you again then, huh? So they get the scrap move, move, and this move. man stink me to oh. oh, like, oh, yeah, the government gave me some augmentation. Look at that headbutt. Two go through I can move. Oh! Robert Yo, that's it. Man. Stay down. So you stay know this down. That's it. Throw in the towel, bro. Song. Throw in the so towel. The cops ended up coming and stopping this fight. But no, no, it wasn't Good. over. Because later on, he get this call on Skype. <laughs> Skype. Any of y'all remember Skype, man? Mm -hmm. What a fact. Does anybody even still use Skype? But anyways, stick me on the phone and he like, What's good, nigga? Just to let you know, we gonna have a rematch. You not done already told the whole world about it. So if you don't show, you a bitch. Toodaloo, Robert. So they yeah, ended I'm not up showing up any show. But Robert called the cops and they ended up arresting Stink Meter. Of but course then, they did. This is where it just got crazy. So Ed Wunsler pulls up to Robert's house and he's like, hey, I heard about your altercation with Stink Meter. So uh, I bailed him out. And now we're going to have a whole fight because I like it. <gasps> so they end up making this a whole fight. A Ain't no way. With promotional material. Everyone's and voted but for while Stink Meter. Robert was training for this fight, something was happening to him. The dark side <laughs> was taking over and he was slowly. Becoming more like stink. Stink meaner. So it's the night of the fight, and you can obviously see the difference. Yes. Man's got the ball spot and everything. Bro became what he wanted to destroy. So oh they start God, the bro. fight, and Robert just kicked him in the face. Whoa. So stink meaner, like, oh, I see. You must have took some I karate see, classes or something. Boom. Yeah, bro, this wasn't even okay, a okay, okay. Oh. Century. But the thing is that you have to think about, though, this isn't really Robert. All this is, is just Robert under Stink Meter's influence. He ended up becoming what he, he wanted hated. to destroy. An old, hating ass nigga. Yes. So here we ended up having to stop it. He's like, Granddad, this Damn. ain't his stop it. Look at the whole crowd, bro. It's just silent. And then this man, Ed, like, mm, looks like this entire event was a flop. This is basically like Yo, a look at Stink Meaner, fight. bro. It was only fun when your ass was getting beat, Robert. All right, everybody, pack it up. Let's count up the pay-per-view sales. So then Robert told Stink Meaner. Oh, Miner, my God. Oh, my God. If I let you live, will you stop messing with me? And Stink Meaner like, I mean, sure. All you did was just have to ask. <laughs> nah, bro. 
I would have killed his ass right there. I'm getting I'm getting lucky and boom, nigga. So that's we it. cut three months later. And this man Sting Meter outside of his house still harassing him. Robert, hey, why you don't ever invite your boy Sting over? That's f***ed up, Robert. So Robert comes to the door. He's like, get off my property. And Sting Meter say, oh, I'm on the sidewalk. And I'm going to be here for the rest of your life, Robert. See you tomorrow at 7. PhD in hating. He really, bro, he a hater, bro. That's it. He just a hater. And that's it. I, right, bro, that was that was good. Oh my god, bro, that was funny. Yo, Stink Meter is just he. He just can't be beaten, bro. I I never knew this happened. Actually, I like I'm still wondering. Like is that like a new episode? Like, did they come back with like a new episode or something? Like, bro, that. That was good, especially when Robert became the thing he hated, and then just said, "You're done." <laughs> he just said, "You're done." But um, anyway, that's it for this video. This is Game of Six signing off. Hope you have a great day, and uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I got one grand on my dummy up. Who caught a mill in my go yard? Yeah. I win the guess, so you still got to show. Born with the drip and just learn how to hustle. Look at your bitch through these DL by folks. Cause I get me some hands, she been that shit over.